A short and precise statement from the Wiper Democratic Movement Kenya signed by Jared Marker Siso, the party executive director sent to the newsrooms earlier today, summarizes the weekend occurrences and concludes with a warning and an expression of disappointment. The press statement reads in part, Wiper Democratic Movement strongly condemns and disassociates itself from the utterances by Kitui West Member of Parliament Francis Nyenze that appear to support Jubilee presidential candidate Uhuru Kenyatta. Further, the statement says Wiper Democratic Movement will no doubt be seeking a clarification from Nyenze as to whether he has, since his nomination as Kitui West parliamentary candidate on a Wiper Democratic Movement ticket, shifted his allegiance from our party to Jubilee candidate, after which we will chart the way forward. These are the utterances that ignited the storm. <laughs> It's, however, not the first time Nyenze is rubbing many in his party the wrong way. Back in March, when the coalition was working on its lineup, Nyenze declared that without his party leader, Kalonzo Musioka, as the presidential candidate, there will be no NASA. He later endorsed the lineup. Up to the last minute, Kalonzo was to be the flag bearer. Up to the last minute. How it changed the night they signed, we were all taken aback. Nyenze, who was also accompanied by Mwingi South Member of Parliament, David Musila, is yet to comment on the wiper statement. Musila, who was also quoted asking the voters to re-elect anyone including President Kenyatta, has however denied endorsing their competitor. <laughs> I respect him very much. I really respect him. I did not expect that from him. Musila says he was misquoted in the reports. Ken Mijungu, NTV.